Everybody and welcome back to Falcon Place Windforged. Uh, let me go ahead and get this hatch open. Let's go uh, find out what our friend Walter's at. Remember, um, Toram told us that this is our secret research facility, and to look for a bottom, or uh, look for a hatch in the bottom right corner of uh, this area. And this is where we are indeed, and this is where uh, Karen is at. How you doing, Karen? Now that the SOC are catching on, I need to stay here in the lab and handle security. If you need any extra edge in combat, you should talk to a friend of mine, Lars von Alderstein. He's an expert with weapon mods, he should be able to teach you a few tricks if, uh, to help you out. He has a shop in Alterstein. Tell him I sent you, he owes me a favor. Ha <laughs> ha! What does that even mean? <laughs> he owes you a favor and then you ha <laughs> ha at the end. You know what, that's something I would make. That's a joke I would make, Carrie, not you. Don't take my material, baby. Uh, so we could use the toilet. Um, <laughs> apparently we could get Uh, you know what, I don't think I'm that desperate for water, man. Um, it's a nice thought, but, uh, don't do that, please. Alright, let's proceed onward over here and see what it's about. Uh, I could open this shit over here. I could break this stuff? What is this? Oh, handgun ammo? I will definitely take that and some money! Money is the crime! Uh, let me go ahead and search this, and machine gun turret recipe! Yes, bitch! Alrighty, and let's... Oh, don't... Dude, don't, don't... Will you stop being all crazy? Like, let me go in through here. Unless this leads me to, uh, the man. I'm looking for. If that's the case, I don't want to do that just yet. I kind of want to explore a bit. Is this oil? Are we hoarding the oil? Are we the bad guy after all? Now right, let me just go up through there, up through there. Y'all go make me lose my nine. Up through there, up through there. Uh, research this. So we got Iron Spikes recipe book, and we got the ship starting frame book. I bought that one just recently. Um, this might be the guy we're looking for, isn't it? I want to explore. I fuck it. My exploring spirit is going to get the best of me. Alrighty, let's just talk to this guy. No, this is Wilhelm. This is not the guy. Hi, I'm Wilhelm. I'm here to help you with Walter Energies, with Walter's energy research, and I will also have a number of special projects on the go that could indirectly help us. Our research may not necessarily be legal, but it's definitely cutting edge. Ha ha ha. I'm actually making great progress on Aderkind Elixir research. I just need help. I just need help, some help in making one and testing it. Are you interested in helping out? Yeah, sure, dude. I love my side quests. Great, here's a copy of the recipe. All you need to do is create one of these elixirs and bring it back to me. Alrighty, so, um, I guess we could use your lab over here. Oh, I do have whatever it's required. A lifestone gem? Why is copper ore, um, so prevalently displayed over here? Alright, whatever, create the item. And let me talk to him now. Ha ha ha! Great, you made an Aderkind elixir. I'll take a small sample of it and you can have the rest. Uh, it's probably safe to drink, but it will make it will make some time. It will takes me a long time to know for sure. It will take me a long time know for sure. Oh, you're missing the two there. Two know for sure, not know for sure. Suddenly, uh, or we could find out right away if you drink it. Ha ha ha. Okay. Um, sure, man. Apparently, I'm Mikey. Let Mikey drink it. Yeah, Mikey will eat anything. Um, where is uh, food and meds? I guess. Which one is it? Where did it go? Is it the elixir of agility? Is that what it is? Permanently increases your agility by 10. Yeah, sure. Fucking it. Alright, well, agility permanently increased by 20, not by 10. Alrighty, well, cool. Uh, I don't. I think that is, was that what I built? Was that what that elixir was about? For my next project, I'm working on an improved hydrogen-based blowtorch. Are you interested in helping out? I indeed am. Great! I already made the prototype for this one. All you need to do is get me some hydrogen to use as fuel. I think 50 units of hydrogen should be sufficient. Okay, and you learn how to make hydrogen. Um, do I do that in the same spot? Hydrogen? I do. Um, it's gonna require water though. Um, and we, we need bottles for water, right? So where would I get bottles? That's the real question. Bottle, bottle, bottle. Ponchos? Not a poncho, even though a poncho would be pretty sweet, honestly, but... Um... We need clot for the poncho? We can make clot, man. We have some cotton. Oh, we need more cotton, though. Dude, I really need to invest in making me some ponchos. <laughs> That's the only thing on my mind now. Make a poncho, Falcon! Make a poncho! Um... Ba -ba -ba. Nope, no bottles. I might have to buy some or find a recipe for it, because I don't have it now. So, alrighty, Walter, uh, good looking out, but we are Wilhelm, but we're done with you. I'm gonna take the time to break your uh, items, though, because, um, unfortunately, it's kind of what I do. Oh, God! Uh, Wil Wilhelm, are you aware of what's in your fucking base over here? 
Um, Wilhelm just died. Now, is this my fault? It's not my fault, right? It can't be my fucking fault. Let me drink a health potion here. Why would you have this here? Like, what is the purpose of this being here? Oh god, Wil Wilhelm, are you alright? Are you gonna come back to life? Um, you have quests for me, you can't die! <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna leave now, cause, uh, fuck that, um... Okay, stop, drop. Just stop and drop. Whoa. Stop and drop. Stop and drop! There we go. Alrighty, and let me use this, I guess? Oh. What? I'm um, not entirely sure what I'm doing. I guess I'm trying to lift off the entire ground that we're in. <laughs> okay, get off of that, man. Falcon, you're being crazy. You can't handle this. This is too much ship for me. Um, either way, I can't go in through there. So, um, let's proceed down this way, I guess. Uh, where is um, that man that I'm looking for, then? Where is uh, Walter? Did I just kill Walter? Don't tell me I killed Walter. Oh, wait a minute. Tab, quest. Find Walter in the lab. To Talk to Walter in the secret lab to get some gear to help defend yourself. Well... Okay, wh where is he though? He doesn't seem to be around here. I mean, the only thing up there is like that fucking, uh... turret that killed Wilhelm. Oh! I, I think I see him, he's trapped! That- that's- th is that him right there? <laughs> Why is he trapped? Okay, one second here. Um, open this up. Oh, he wasn't trapped. He was just uh, covered by some uh, debris. Walter, in my calcula if my calculations are correct, these changes should be able to fucking blow the breaches off of a... Hey, don't curse, Walter. You don't even know me. Maybe I'm not into that. Or, um, I didn't see you there. I'm Walter, the lead researcher around here. What can I do for you? Ah, yes. Things are going to get a lot more complicated now that the effin SOC is starting to take notice. You know what, Walter? Only I can curse in my playthrough, not you. I can help you out. Take these machine gun turrets and place them on your ship. They should help you defend yourself while flying your facility. Alrighty, cool. I'm also giving you a radio. If you get stuck somewhere, you can use it to call for help. Anyways, feel free to explore the facilities here. Just be a effin careful in the testing area below. Oh yeah, you might also want to talk to Wilhelm in the lab upstairs. He has a few space or research projects in, in queue that you might find interesting. Well, about Wilhelm, Walter. I don't think, um, yeah, I don't think he's gonna have any uh, researches anymore. Uh, once you've done, once you're done, you should go check back with Thora and see if she's done with the translation tablet. Yeah, about your friend, though, um, yeah, I don't think it's gonna happen anytime soon. But okay, thanks a lot for the information nonetheless. Um, you know, we were able to complete one of his quests, I believe, so <laughs> there's that. <laughs> okay, let's just uh, head back to Thora. Thora, Thora. Hey, I'm sorry if uh, the game's getting framey for some reason. I don't know why. I'm not sure if it's just that area or if it's just in my recording session today. Shouldn't be. I mean, I've been recording this thing fine. I did read about, like, some of the other things that I read about about this game, um... Other than what I mentioned about the save files, is that apparently it gets really framey in certain parts of the game, so... I'm not sure if that's for everybody. Probably it's, uh, as, a uh, each person's different, uh... Computer takes it differently, but, uh, apparently I have read about, um the game getting framing in a certain area of the game and for all I know it's probably where we're just at right now so I guess it might affect me too because everything else has been recording just fine but that area right there starting to get a little bit framing so I apologize for that hopefully it uh doesn't affect us any further and I'm going back as you can see going through the uh the I guess the bookcases that I didn't really check the first time around because I wasn't aware that you can check those so it's probably in our best interest to do so because it gives us more recipes and the more recipes we have, the better we can deck out our shipment and whatnot. Because we don't want to keep that same old moldy ship for a long time, right? We kind of want to make our own ship and see what goes on about it. Um, this is where we were just at, right? So, all I just did was honestly just turn us the fuck around. Uh, let me just cut through here then and call it quits and let's just head back to, uh, Thora, right? Is that where I'm going for? Quest, uh, see Thora for your next job. Right, right, and Thora was... Oh wait, Thora was... What the fuck is this guy's problem? <laughs> Why is it every time he sees me, he goes nuts? I don't get it. What have I done to you? Um, Thora is not in the ship. That's where I was heading. Thora is actually down below over here, I remember. I remember I kind of ran into her <laughs> on mistake alone. I was kind of like, oh yeah, yeah. Hi, how you doing? You're exactly who I was looking for. 
This is not Dora. That's a guy. I think Dora was a female, if I remember correctly. So, let's just look for a Feminina. I think, uh, that's her right here, if I remember correctly. How do I get there? How do I get there? Oh, simple enough. Let's jump through here. Alrighty, how you doing, Thora? You're back! I hope Walter didn't give you a hard time. Well, not him, but his fucking energy turret did. I managed to decipher the tablets you gave me. Now I should be able to read Ancient Adrican. Wow, that was really fast. I deciphered the tablet that you gave me, some sort of really foreign, other kind of, uh, tablet, and suddenly I have become completely infilled with the knowledge to read anything Aetherkind from now on, which is quickly quite impressive, Dora, but okay. I'll take your word for it. We need to find more Aetherkind tablets so we can learn more. You know what? You're a little bit too thirsty for knowledge, Dora. That's a bad thing. Apparently, there are numerous Aetherkind temples of knowledge scattered throughout the world. The temple you explored recently was one of them. I know the locations of a few more. I'll mark them on your map. I don't know what we will find at each one, but it will pay you generously for each Aetherkind tablet you can give me. Also, be careful. My sources tell me that the SOC might be guarding the temples now. They will probably shoot on sight. That's cool. Uh, get the tablets that Dora mentioned. Check your map for temple locations. Alright, so I think we're pretty much done here. Um, now comes the aspect of the game where I could pretty much do some uh, crafting and building. Uh, you know, upgrading our ship and whatnot. Before we continue onward. Um, I'm also stuck over here, so that was probably not the best situation for me to get us involved in. So instead, I'm going to go ahead and not be able to break this? Are you kidding me? Am I stuck now? Break. 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 Um, this can't be right. Oh yeah, yeah never mind. I'm not stuck. Forgot that I have my Indiana Jones thing. I haven't used it in a while. I forgot it was there. So, um, if you guys don't mind, let me just do this and go back through the ministry over here with these guys that keep on looking at me really weird. Like, what's this guy's problem? Is it the green hair guys? Yeah, you know, I made him purposely that way, I guess. So let's get the hell on out of this town. Yeah, this guy's gonna run it. What are you- do, You know what? You're fucking pissing me off. I will cut you right now. Do you want that? Is that what you want? I will cut you. Alrighty, you and your friend over here. Alrighty, so um, this is not our ship just yet. Pretty nice little setup, though. I'm not sure how if it keeps you guys warm, but I like the setup. It's a nice setup. Alrighty. So let's go on back over here. Karen is, uh, who the fuck is this? Karen, I thought, stayed behind. Let's just a dock master. You're, you're the dock master now? You look better than the first guy. I mean, I'm kind of into that bald look, honestly. Uh, alright, bye. Um, dock master, can you, um, you know, fuck off so I could leave now, though? That'd be great. So let's go into the weapon. Oh, God. What's wrong with my dude? Stop looking up. <laughs> He's hunchback now. Apparently I hurt my back in the walk over here. Um, cool. Yeah, I'll see you around, too. So, let's look at our map really quickly. Search for the Vision Temple, search for the Fire Temple, find Atrian Artichaft. Alright, so the ones down here we've completed. So right now we have to search uh, three different temples. So I guess the Vision Temple will be the first one since it's the one that's marked. Uh, the world map will tell us a bit about this. So this is a shipwreck. Temple of Language. We are... So this is where we're at right now, right? So we want to go to the Temple of Vision, which is to the left-hand side. Alrighty, that makes perfect sense. I could go to that one. So get on out of here and... Um... Press E to use, and, uh, alright, Doc Master, I guess you're coming along. Hopefully you're, uh, okay with, uh, breaking the rules of our society, because that's exactly what we're doing. We are telling you, we are telling our society, fuck you, we want to use this, uh, technology that's been forbidden. Oh, hey, pirates. Pirates who are stuck to us now. <laughs> okay, I guess we're coming along. That one just decided to commit suicide. Oh, it sucks for you guys, your balloons- Oh, no! Oh, no! Uh-oh. Oh, why is there a dragon there, too? No! Oh, no! Basilisk, go away! Basilisk, go- Dockmaster, fight the Basilisk! Oh, no, we've crash-landed. I don't want to crash-land. Oh, no, our balloon! Who is this guy? Who the hell is he to fuck around with us this way? Okay, drink the potion and jump. Oh, no, it's all falling apart. It's all coming to pieces. Switch to the gun, Falcon. Shoot this guy, Falcon. Shoot this fucking Basilisk. He does not belong in here. Alright, I think he's dead. Alrighty, um... You know who's not dead? I think the Dog Master died too. Sorry, Dog Master. Well, you'll probably be replaced by somebody else though. Um, wow, that was terrifying. Let's just repair this. <laughs> I guess at least I don't have to build it again. That is the upside. All I have to do is make it in there in one place, uh, in one piece I should say, and then we can just kind of use my repair tool and nothing ever happened. Nobody's the wiser. So let me just quickly... Maneuver my ship up. Oh, no! Wait a minute. 
Why? Okay, you know what? I should probably really invest in that machine turret. Uh, that machine gun turret that they told me about. Oh, god damn it. So these guys just fly around the whole game and just fuck you up. Is that what I'm getting at here? Must be. So, um, let me just repair my ship and okay. Hold up. Oh god, no, don't do it, Wolfman. Let me just hang out over here then. Oh god, don't hang out there, Falcon. Okay, I died now. <laughs> Shit. Uh, load. Load, I let's do our, our auto save, maybe. Will we will we be here? If it is, then we're we're cool. Oh god damn it! Alright guys, and we're back in here, so um, I went ahead and just fucking flew straight ahead to the left, and um, I think that it was able to, it made me avoid just about everything. The Dock the doc Master is still here alive, uh, I just fucking flew over here fast as hell. I missed everybody on the way, like nobody spawned this time, which was kind of weird. But either way, um, we're gonna go ahead and equip myself my gun here. Dock Master is really starting to annoy the hell out of me. Get out of here, Dock Master. Um, so I flew down to here. Uh, I imagine that... We have to probably follow that little wrench. Is that going to be our quest, perhaps? Um, quest, yeah. So, I guess we could have probably made it easier on ourselves by... Oh, God. <laughs> oh, there goes the dog master. Okay, that's cool. You guys uh, multiply all the time anyway. So, I fell all the way down here. Probably not the best idea, but whatever. We'll, we'll figure something out. So, let me jump. Do this, and then jump again, and alright, there we go. So, uh, I'm not sure where I'm at, or why there is this here, but I could use this. Alright, let's go in here and maybe, um, is this like a, an abandoned facility of some kind, or am I just breaking into somebody's uh, homestead? I can't be sure. I can't be sure to be honest with you, but we're going to continue exploring it. Uh, oh, it looks completely abandoned. There's nobody around here. Remember that they, they did tell us that there are going to probably be um, actual people from the SOC looking into uh, temples because uh, people are breaking into them now. But, you know what, there's absolutely nothing here. Oh, shit. Yeah, there's nothing absolutely here. Maybe I could pretty much claim this to my own land. Who needs oil when I have all this to myself in reality, right? Um, let me break myself through here. I don't want to go all the way around again. I said I don't want to go all the way around again. Okay, let's just continue. I guess, uh, fuck it. Well, we, we know that this is here at least, so... If we ever feel the need to, like, you know, claim a land of our own, then here we go. This is pretty much abandoned. It's, like, completely built. Search this out. What do we have here? Concentrated poison recipe. Alrighty. All good. Um, now I guess we'll just have to cut ourselves through here. So I'm much too lazy to go all the way around. It's all, it's all good, man. It's all good. Thankfully, this jackhammer never lets us down. Just gotta cut on away. Get into the minerals. Oh god. Go faster though! Go faster! <laughs> I only have so much patience. Uh, here's what I meant about um, stuff landing on you, by the way. So here I'm being really vigilant about uh, making sure that these stones don't land on me as they fall down. It would have probably been in my best interest to um, fly the ship all the way to the entrance of the tunnel. But obviously I didn't do that. I was just kind of worried of uh, those uh, goddamn dogs like following me or the, the basilisk that showed up out of nowhere. I mean, I guess now we know why they have uh, squirrel wings after all, right? They're just built that way for a reason. Okay, where are we going? You know, I'm taking a lot of damage. Let me pop one of these health items here. And there's a lot of abandoned stuff here, which is cool. Rifle ammo, nice. Uh, handgun ammo. Alright. There's a lot more stuff down there. For a vicious explorer like myself. Alright, let go. Let go of it. And I just want to make sure that I get all this stuff. So basically, these are like abandoned, you could say. Or not abandoned, but crude bronze propeller. Nice. Um, these are basically leftover remnants of like uh, old civilizations or old ships, so to say. That have been like, you know, crash landed and whatnot. So when you break them down, it basically gives you like a random chance at a certain item and whatnot. So that's what those are there for. Pretty interesting indeed. Let me just cut through there. Now, I'm not sure if this is the right path. Obviously, from this point on, we're running blind. I knew about the first temple, but um, from here on out, it's all good. We kind of have to kind of explore. But at the same time, it gives me a chance to kind of... Oh, shit! It gives me a chance to die, apparently. Oh, don't send me back to town. Don't do it. All right, it didn't send me back to town, but it sent me back to that little abandoned giant mansion that I found. So just keep that in mind for next time as I fall and take some more fall damage here. Okay. Okay, and there is a, a dude over there now, so it'll probably be in my best interest to... Are you part of the SOC if you are? 
Why we gotta fight like this, man? Let me go ahead and uh, arm myself for one. And we will take care of this mother... F oh, God! Suddenly he has really amazing uh, pathing there. Oh, I got a blue explorer jacket, I think. Pretty cool, pretty cool. All right, you motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, how do you how do you like that? Yeah, he dropped some money for me, bitch. All right, so we got him there, and uh, we got some money, more handgun ammo, iron spikes, and a healing bomb as well. That's not bad at all. All righty, um, we got an explorer jacket, I believe, so let's go our clothes and... Uh, explorer jacket, yeah, go ahead and equip it. Um, torso, I guess? Yeah! <laughs> yeah, look at this shit. I guess we're no longer rocking the wife beater anyway. So, I think it's probably in my best interest to, I guess I could go up through there, but considering that dude came out of here, I imagine there's probably some booty and plunder to go about over here, so it's probably my best interest to stay on this pad for now. Uh, the other thing I should be trying to do is every time we get the chance to get some cotton, because um, cotton is what we are going to need to in order to build some more, uh, at least some basic equipment for us, um, and I like to kind of deck my dude out to look pretty badass if I get the chance. It's part of one of the things I like about like games like this, where it gives you the chance to kind of deck out your dude with different type of abilities or different type of styles and whatnot. Don't die to the same thing again, Falcon! Okay. <laughs> I like to say that I did that by um, chance alone or by skill, but that was actually the luckiest thing of all time. So right now what we're going to do is actually <laughs> mow this up a bit. I'm trying to give myself a ledge to jump on here and go back because, oh god, don't fall. Let me just make a little indent in here. Okay. Um, that's really terrifying. I don't think I want to go down that path anymore. Fuck that, man. Uh, oh god! What is that? Oh god! Why are you so violent and vicious? No, go away. Go away. Go, go away. Fucking unknown creature from the abyss. Alrighty, fuck that, man. Where? No. Let me... No. Right there. It's good. Okay. Oh, I, dog man is okay. I don't mind dealing with dog man. It's just that weird beast that came. Oh, rubber boots, nice. All right, so he's gonna go down this way, I guess. Fuck it. Oh god, damn it! Fist nut. All right, let's just go up through there then. I guess we'll just kind of keep maneuvering ourselves up there. We'll get to it eventually. <laughs> through hooker crook. Oh, oh, what are you doing? Get off of that. Get off of that rope that way. Pervert. And oh shit. You gotta be shitting me, man. What do I do here now? Just go through the whole. Alright, let's see. Let's try our luck again. I said, let's try our luck again. Let me just carve this out a bit and... Oh, God, I missed it completely. Alright, stop missing it. God damn it. Alright, there we go. Oh, God, I, I just hooked, I hooked on and I did it. I, I, I looked like I had skill there for a second. Jump. Let it loose. Jump again. All right. Now we jump and we hit the key. Oh, God, dog. Go away. Oh, I could hook onto the dog. And then I could ride him down. Oh. <laughs> and I could die. <laughs> that was awesome. Fuck it. Let's call it an episode here today, guys. And um, I'll get to the, uh, the proper pet. I'm just going to take the ship to the fucking entrance of that temple. Obviously, going through the long way is a bit fun, but uh, a little bit troubling as well. But hopefully, you enjoyed the episode and uh, hopefully, you enjoyed me, uh, I guess. Not only using the propeller to hang myself onto that dog, but then riding him down too. It was pretty amazing. <laughs> Either way, I will catch you next time.